Every great engineering project starts long before construction. It starts in a digital world. At Rosebank Mall, we used 3D modeling and advanced design simulation to formalize and build every single aspect of the system before a single cable was installed. Let's take a closer look at how precision engineering shaped this project. This is where it all began, where the team built a complete digital model of the entire project. Using Autodesk Revit and CAD, they were able to optimize, test, and perfect the design before construction started. 3D modeling played a critical role in ensuring the project's success. Through optimized plant room layouts, it reduced wasted space and ensured full accessibility. By cable tray routing simulations, it minimized material use and cutting installation cost. And collision detection modeling prevented costly installation errors and reroutes. By testing every scenario in a virtual environment first, we eliminated design conflicts before they became real world problems. In the beginning, York Bros Constructions was approached um, by the client to facilitate the digital twin of a project in Africa that is going to set standards. So my first initial thought was to involve Modena Infrastructure as, a, as my consultant. Modena, AEC and Infrastructure are digital construction partners. So the correct tool set for this particular project was um, Autodesk Revit, Autodesk Construction Cloud, and it included Holobuilder and Matterport. So once we received the mandate from Lee with regards to the Hyprop project, we built and decided on a digital strategy in regards to the digital twin around utilizing the Matterport as well as the Holobuilder solutions um, to capture um, the site. Spending and utilizing the capital upfront was worth the investment due to the constraints that we foresaw um, with this project yes. where we knew the benefits would pay back hundredfold mm. towards the end. Mm -hmm. With the, the digitalization of, of, of the, the mall and the best project, um, utilizing Autodesk Revit speeds up the process in getting the designs, the liaising with all the engineers and getting the information timelessly. I think that was what, what saved it in the beginning as well. And because it was housed on the Autodesk Construction Cloud, as advised by, by Medina, we could have access to that platform and all the models were live at all times, 24-7. We as the, the BIM technicians, the, the engineers, the architects, the, the um, facilities managers, we all had our input into that and it was all available 24-7. We didn't have to wait for lengthy boardroom meetings. Traditional construction often runs into installation conflicts where cables, conduits and equipment don't fit this plan. By using collision detection simulations, we flagged and resolved clashes between cable trays, HVAC ducts and electrical panels. We optimized equipment placement, ensuring easy access for future maintenance and we reduced last minute modifications, keeping the project on budget and on schedule. This level of precision is what sets modern engineering projects apart. This is where digital meets reality. Every component was first built virtually to ensure that when we got to site, it fits exactly as planned. With detailed 3D planning, we ensured seamless alignment between design and execution, reduction of unexpected field modifications and shorter installation times, as all routing was predefined. By using digital engineering, 
we were able to optimize not just cost saving, but overall project execution. From the mandate, from the discussion, I went to site and we spoke with uh, Nathan and the client regarding Hollowbuild and the benefits that on-site progress tracking would deliver to the client. It gave us the ability to look back in time and understand what the project actually looked like on a specific day. Mm -hmm. And the photo speaks a thousand words. Mm -hmm. Failing in pixels is much cheaper than failing in reality. Nathan and them also wanted something that you could actually walk through, an actual mm -hmm. visual 3D tour of what the site looks like yeah. so that they can also then share that with other clients and if, which for facilities management is also perfect mm. because with that they can see physically what it actually looked like and then if there is a problem they can go back and see okay there's a problem this is what it's supposed to look like the visual side of it really just brings it back into reality yes. into life the battery room was actually designed in the beginning in a 90 degree um, orientation it was only through using the Revit mm -hmm. and the clash detection and it was then that we realized that he has a major clash. We probably saved Hyprop about 3 million rand yeah. in a big catastrophic clash where it's just not going to fit. 100%. And yeah. before the, 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 the first hammer was put down to, to demolish a door or before the first bucket of concrete was made, mm -hmm. we had already captured that and changed the design and then put it out on, yeah. on, on the design yeah. points. The benefits of 3D pre-planning include lower material cost through precise cable tray routing, reduced labor cost thanks to optimized equipment placement, and shorter project timelines, as all work was predefined digitally. By the time construction started, the project was already fully planned, optimized, and ready to execute. Three D engineering changed our entire approach to this project, ensuring precision, efficiency, and cost saving. But there's one more component: the engineering beyond the design. In our next video, we look at the engineering disciplines that made this project possible. Follow us as we look at this engineering marvel of smart energy systems.